lady. I'll call you back. Hey, wait, wait, wait. Where are you going? Are you addressing me, young man? You're not sneaking out of here without paying your bill. I'm not sneaking anywhere, Mr. Bellamy. So what are you doing with the bag? Well, I happen to be taking some clothes to the cleaners. Yeah. What do you think I was born yesterday? Oh, whenever and wherever you were born, you were certainly not raised like a gentleman. I'll keep the bag until you come up with the rent. This is an outrage. So sue me. I'm not just anyone you know. My daughter is a U-in. A Texas U-in. And my brother-in-law is a Rockefeller. <laughs> and you mind your own business. Yeah, here. Hey, lady. The library's down the street. That's how I make my living here. Piper, Piper, all the paper. Get your paper here. All the streets, you know, all of them.
be skinned alive. Hey, nice go, Lee. Terrific. I didn't want that one anyway. Hmm. <laughs> He's a great guy, make these himself. Gary, you can't stop it. You know, I think he's kind of nervous about this. Really? Hasn't sat down. I know, that's what, what I mean. Do it. Do it. Maybe she's working late. He's a great guy. Yeah, good. I'll get him. Okay. Hi. Hi there. We brought the baby. Oh, yeah. oh that's all right. Of course. Well, let me see her. Let me see her. Oh, she's a darling. <laughs> what are we calling her? Erin or Molly? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Both. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what's your baby? Hello, Molly. My oh, God, you got enough stuff here to support the Eighth Army. Oh, you oh, look at her. Cute. Oh, and she's the sweetest thing in the whole wide world. Uh, she's Kenny's nose, definitely. <laughs> she's finally lost that pinched look. <laughs> well, all newborns have it, <laughs> but mine. <laughs> I'm gonna put her upstairs. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Honey, we're setting the stuff up down here. Let's have her here. Let's put her. You got your hand out. Oh, hi. Did I miss it? Unfortunately, no. Oh. Hi, I'm sorry I'm late. I, I got hung up with Michael. He's going on a field trip tomorrow to the tide pools, and he... Oh, I thought you were <laughs> Kenny. And, and he couldn't find his rubber boots. <laughs> you got plenty of service, yeah, right? Yeah, it's almost time. Oh, wait a minute. Yep, we can do the right now. Oh. What time? No, 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 no you're just going to come. It's okay. We'll be back after a brief commercial announcement. No, and coming right. up next, <laughs> bag lady, Good. bag smugger. Yep, th this is it. Here it comes. Hi, friends. Yay! I'm Gary Ewing of Knox Landing Motors, and I'd like to tell you about the super savings we have on sale. Looking for a sporty, compact, yeah. an economy model with plenty of legs. Arms. A luxurious Nothing's executive sedan arms. to match the most expensive European import. Right, well, we've got it. That jacket and super looks great. savings, too. Frankly, friends, uh, we're overstocked, and we've got to move these cars and move them now. This is a great copy. So come on down to Knox Landing Motors for the super saving deal of your life. And don't forget, friends, we service what we sell. That's Knott's Landing Motors, one block east of the freeway between Carrington and Hargrove, for the super saving deal of your life. Yay! I told you I'd be awful. Oh, you were not awful. Mm, you were terrific. Wasn't he terrific? Well, let me put it to you this way. Don't. <laughs> really, you were super. And so sincere, a man you'd buy a used car from. <laughs> According to bystanders, the homeless, slightly built woman nabbed the alleged mugger single-handedly, knocking him down with a shopping cart. For a you know, you reminded me of someone. Yeah. Kirk Douglas. Kirk oh, I knew there was some Robert Redford. Thanks, Marcia. Well, just how weak is the weaker sex? I'm here with Mrs. Lily A. Clements, yes. songwriter, uh, performer, grandmother, and as of today, crime fighter. Uh, you, John, Can you tell you us what happened here this afternoon? Okay. Well, it wasn't much to it. A man was making off with that poor woman's purse, so I stopped him. Uh -huh. Well, now, I understand you were evicted from your hotel this morning. <laughs> oh, no, you've got that wrong, young man. Uh, you didn't give me an address. Uh, now, does that mean you're living here in the park? Oh. Well, that's how it is in show business, you know, up one day and down the next. I'm hey, Val. Do you want coffee? Look at this. I toured at one time with uh, Maybell Carter back in Tennessee. Mama. Well, the question here is, is a lady who cared enough to get involved going to have a roof over her head tonight? Steve Salt from Memorial Park reporting. Back to you now, Marsha.